Hello viewers, welcome to a new video. Today I am in Oakworth in West Yorkshire and I'm going to show you Springhead Mill which was built by John Heaton around the mid 18th century. This mill later became owned by the Merrills who were a very well known mill owning family around the Oakworth and Haworth area and I'm going to talk about the history of their incredible empire. So this is Springhead Mill and it's actually being used now as living accommodation so it's good to see that it's still being put to really good use. So I'm going to show you around and really get into some interesting history for you and talk about the mill owners and all the industry across the Worth Valley and I'm just sat on the wall just at the front of the mill and just behind me is the River Worth and this mill was a cotton mill it was built as a actual purpose built cotton spinning mill and it was powered by the river just behind me which is called the River Worth and I'll talk about all that in this video too so I hope you enjoy this video everybody don't forget to like share and subscribe and I'll get into the history for you cheers everyone John Heaton was a manufacturer of cotton pieces he employed a considerable number of local weavers at Springhead Mill many of the workers wove the pieces at their own homes before Heaton employed them at the mill and paid them a fair wage. Mr Heaton would regularly attend the Manchester market to negotiate the sale of his pieces and also purchase much needed raw cotton. Many of the mills along the Worth Valley were powered and sourced by the River Worth. Hartley Merrill really excelled with his manufacturing skills at Springhead Mill. He took the mill from strength to strength and employed a huge amount of local combers and weavers. After a few years, he took his four sons into the partnership. Edwin, Michael, Stephen and Hartley Jr. all added their own expertise to the business. They went extensively into the merino trade. The merino was a highly prized soft fine wool which was established in Spain during the Middle Ages. The Merrills were very highly motivated enterprising industrialists. The firm, including the junior partners, Michael and Stephen, went on to build further mills along the Worth Valley and expand the firm. They also built day schools 
and Sunday schools as well as a Methodist chapel. The Merrills were a very religious family.